now that I have the overflow set up properly, and uh, not too not too long from now, we start seeing moss blocks overflowing and then pushing back up to <laughs> the bone meal factory up there. <laughs> uh, hold on, let me, did I drop any hoppers over here? No. Alright, so the other part of this ridiculous line of hoppers is from there to there. <laughs> This game already lags, by the way, because of how much stuff I have. It's too many machines. Alright, get up here, get up here. So I need to get across. Try not to fall down. Yeah, is that right? Looks right to me. How is this? Hey, did you manage to find out what caused the leak into the overflow chest? Yes, Hava. I well, I think so. I think it's because of lag. And I fixed it too. Hold on, let me um, finish this ridiculous line of hoppers and then I'll show you what I did. Uh, are we here? We're here. Oops. Oh, wait, no, this should be a hopper. Uh... That there. Close the, this off. <laughs> and then um, something, something. One, two, three, four. Did I count that right? Probably not. Um. And then I need the the clock. Uh, all right, what am I showing you? I'm showing you this. Ow. All right, so I think it's because of lag, and because it lags, so it uh, like it skips the hoppers. How it says, I didn't know you could move stuff up like that. I thought we were still stuck with the water elevator. Yeah, you can have a dropper elevator. The problem with the dropper elevator is that it makes noise unless you turn it off. Right. Uh, so the the way I deal with lag is I put a throttle on this hopper here so that instead of it pushing items through at full speed, it only pushes items through whenever the redstone torch turns off. And so then here we have like item, no item, item, no item. So it slows down the... So you see how that's faster? Right, see how that that is faster? And that's a bit slower. So I think by slowing it down, we compensate for the lag, and therefore nothing goes into this box anymore. Basically, we give the, the sort of more time to, to process the items. So I think that was the problem. Um, I'm not sure, but since I've put in the throttle, I've kind of AFK for a few hours. And it seems like it doesn't push any more items into here. So I think it works. Not sure. But um, like if if the lag is causing the hoppers and things to to work out of sync, it does actually mean that I need to stop building more factories because <laughs> because if the lag is gonna start breaking the circuitry and all that, then then we eventually we're gonna run into problems, right? Um, I'm kind of almost done with the factories anyway, so I'm gonna like build a few more, but then we might have reached the limit of how far we can push this. Um, okay, and talk, speaking of pushing this, we're going to push extra bone meal over to the flower factory, which is there. 
And I need to put in... Uh, oh, I need more blocks. What do I need? I need dust. Observers. Alright, let me uh, put in the observer ladder. I guess the observer ladder has to be on this side. Let me go up beside this, actually. It might be easier. Alright, that one. And then we want... Observer looking that way. Looking... Really? How is that pointing down? Um, if I go down here... There you go. And then on this side, observer looking... That way. Alright, and then we go... Wait, that's not right. We go dust, observer... Block, dust, observer, block. Oh, speaking of lag breaking things, I think the lag has also broken the farmers. I don't think the farmers work properly anymore. Like that guy, like what's he doing? I don't think he can even find his own bed. His own bed is right there, but look at him. He's just like walking back and forth. Look at him. <laughs> I think the lag has also broken the farmers. I mean, the lag is stopping me from putting these items down, too. Alright, so if any bone meal comes over here, that should go up that and into the flower factory, which we can test if we... Grab some bone meal from here. Oh, this thing's completely stopped. Has it? Maybe it hasn't. No, no, it hasn't. Alright, still going. So if I grab those, right? And I put those in. In. Not there. In. There. That will get fed into the flower factory, and then the flower factory will start working. Pro probably. <laughs> All right, let's hang out here. Now, which one does it prioritize? I forgot. This one. So it should come out this one first. 41. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna wait wait for Allium. No? No. Oh, yes. <laughs> there it is, Allium. Oh, look at those flowers. Okay. Um, <laughs> the bone meal comes... <laughs> anyway, so... Alright. Alright, cool. Bone meal factory... When that is completely full of bone meal, any extra goes in the moss factory. 
When the moss factory is completely full, any extra bone meal goes into the flower factories. Great. Uh, the question is, do I build another bone meal factory on top of this bone meal factory, just for more bone meal? I kind of want to. I kind of do want to build another bone meal factory. Will produce bone meal twice as fast, because at this rate, it's going to take a very, very, very long time for the the flowers to fill up, right? Even for the moss to fill up, I'm going to have to like, AFK for many, many hours. Okay, let's let's go ahead and build another another moss up, another bone meal factory on top of that. So this, those, so that module, another one above. Going to need a lot more. Hoppers, probably. Oh no, I don't, because I just uh, I just recycled this one. What am I talking about? All I need to do is recycle the prototype, because I don't need the prototype anymore. And I can feed all of this bone meal into the to production. All right, let me switch this off. All right, we are recycling. Recycling the... Oh, I need to take the bone meal out before anything. Alright, lava buckets, normal buckets, and... Let's put some of this stuff away for now. Oh, I do have hoppers there. Alright, good to know. I'll speed this up a little bit. Gotta make sure I put it in the right place though, because I might get confused as to where this stuff goes. So the bone meal goes in there, right? And in there. And in there. Gonna take a while to process actually. I can also put the bone meal in the moss factory below. Absolute crap ton of bone meal in here. Right, I can also put the bone meal into there. Still have a lot more bone meal. <laughs> what happened? It's a while for this to 
to go through, huh? in there without breaking anything. I mean, this is probably the output, right? Alright, cool. Very good. And in fact, let me just check this real quick. Alright, that's gonna take a little while. Let me start demolishing this from the top. And I'm sure we'll pick up all bone meal along the way. Just flowing out. <laughs> Should be fine. Oh no, don't break that stuff. Okay, I need to not break that stuff because all the bone meal is inside there. Uh, there's water in here too. Let me throw the water in. The water is inside the pistons. Space do I have? Plenty. Let's make sure that everything's good so far. was this stone? Uh, that's not right. <laughs> Did I mess up the... The, um... Stone generators kind of messed up.
I guess it's not really a problem, like it doesn't stop the stone generators from working. Oh, there's cobble in there? That shouldn't be cobble. <laughs> that shouldn't be cobble. <laughs> uh, there should be nothing down here. I mean, it, that's just a space to catch the water. Uh, I guess, um... Maybe the, the stone generators don't work as smoothly as I... As I thought they should. <laughs> 